Hello, it's hump day. How you doing, Dave Major here? Okay, these are the four important keys in vision. One thing I just want to say, we've done a lot of marketing. I'm a good marketer, but it's not about getting new patients, getting new patients, getting new patients. Well, I was looking on the outside for in almost kind of like I'd like to take a pill because I'm hurting with new patients. I need I need some to keep replenishing it. A wellness practice is people who come into the practice um, and you convert them to wellness. Why wellness? The why to wellness? Because by education, education. So I'm going to do a series in the next couple of weeks before you let the whole year go by and realize what's the importance and, and how to communicate the value and the benefit. Um, and for the patient to go, that makes sense. Okay. On home day. So number one, your eyes fix. You got to see the mission. You know, you are the mission. You are the mission. That's why you became a chiropractor. Why did you become a chiropractor? Okay, I want you to respond. Why did you become a chiropractor? No why, no comply. You got to know the why. Number two, every step you take, take forward in the direction of your goals. Take forward. Even in the little steps, take forward steps going towards your goal. Do you ever go walk in and sometimes you hit a big hill <laughs> like I, and you just kind of look down and just take one step at a time. And all of a sudden you look up and you go, wow, I've come a long way. So every step, you know, and like the one book was great. Fail forward. If, you, if you're going to trip and fall, fall forward, not backwards. All right. Number two, mer, uh, you know, move a purpose. Number three, I'm sorry. Move a purpose. Have your vision before you. And guess what? Strengthen it every day. And you will strengthen every day as you go towards your mission, your vision, and your purpose in life. You will, because you'll see it, you know, start to uh, fruition, could become, to become, to have, you know, become to fruition. There you go. I get excited. And the last one, don't be ignorant of challenge or obstacles you'll encounter, because you will. But what lesson are you going to learn from that? What lesson are you going to learn from that? That's what you got to think about, okay? So, it is, you know, get your eyes fixed on your mission. You are the mission, the vision, get that vision. And then also every step, take forward towards your goals. Number three, go with purpose. See your vision before you strengthen it every day. And when obstacles and stuff come your way, face them head on, face them head on. Um, I might show you next time, but there's a pyramid. And guess what? The top 3% that are successful, you know, they look for problems. They encourage them. They challenge, they, are, they accept them. They don't freak out. And somebody said today, and I won't say their name, but I'm coaching them, I put my head in the sand. Don't put your head in the sand. Face it. It makes you stronger. Okay? All right. So ready? Get your game face on. One, two, three. Game face. And always remember, you got to inspire yourself, inspire the person, and you'll be better at, at home, number one, or with your family and loved ones, and then at the office. Okay? All right. Remember, home day. Take care. God bless. And um, please call me because you got to get fired up. <laughs> please get fired up. The, the people in your community are waiting for it.